Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Tanya and if you're stopping by for the first time, then welcome. Thank you very much. I hope you'll consider subscribing. And if you're not stopping by for the first time, then welcome back and thank you so much for your support. You know exactly how much it means to me. I'm growing peeps. I'm growing just a little, little, little bit. I'm so excited. <laughs> anyway, so today will be my birthday haul video. I will have to film this in two parts because I'm still awaiting two items that have not arrived yet because of you know COVID and everything Australia Post is not able to deliver as frequently as they usually do and there's a backlog because everyone's home so everyone's online shopping and Australia Post just can't keep up so that video will come a little bit later and probably in a different setting because by the time that happens I think I will be out of this house some of you will know that I'm moving out of this house um, and so my environment my background will look somewhat different in videos to come and this probably will be my probably will be my last haul video in this place which is somewhat sad because I actually started this channel in this house um, about five six years ago so anyway bittersweet but doesn't matter moving on moving on so let me share with you a few items that I received I was blessed to receive I'm eternally grateful for the beautiful gifts that were given to me there are some things here that I'll share that I purchased for myself with money that I had saved up and uh, some beautiful items that were given to me as gifts there are some things that I don't have with me anymore because they've been consumed <laughs> and so I will put photos here of what those items were I received beautiful gifts from my beautiful close family friends and people that I, at work who I now deem to be my friends so let's get going first thing I like to share is the chocolates that were given to me by some people at work and I received probably <laughs> these three plus another two lots of chocolate uh, one of those boxes I've condensed and put into this so having said that I have been doing really well because this box is still full and it was my birthday on the 28th of July so that's not bad considering it. Um, but having said that this packet is still going strong and I am controlling myself and preventing myself from eating chocolate every day these I'm looking forward to cracking into too from a couple of other people at work I also received beautiful bottles of goodies one was um, Aperol which I quite love I love me an Aperol spritz if you offer me an Aperol spritz Spritz, I'm there and I received a beautiful bottle of, of Tasmanian white Pinot Grigio which was delicious I of course have consumed it <laughs> and a beautiful bottle of Prosecco but those latter two I have already packed away so I can't I don't have them here with me to show you and another item from someone at work is this delicious beautiful candle and this is by the brand Glasshouse and you will have seen many of these on YouTube especially by Australian youtubers this one is called forever Florence and the packaging is beautiful it just feels like a beautiful velour finish but it's not it's smooth it's just it's brushed and it feels silicony that's what it feels like you know like a like a silicon primer that's what it feels like black inside look at the beautiful coloring the peach and the black anyway opening up and it's a beautiful glass house makes beautiful beautiful candles I have received I think two or three of these now this is my third and this is what the packaging looks like beautiful glass jar it's got the gold print on it and it says glass house fragrances and it is forever Florence which is wild peonies and lily and then just details about the candle and oh god this person chose well very well it's very it's um luxurious it's floral but it's got a depth to it and the floral is expensive it smells almost like a Louis Vuitton it's like a it's there's an element of sweetness it smells like an expensive perfume so mm, if this person's watching thank you I love this I can't wait to burn this when I'm in my own home <sighs> I gotta buy it first they're from my beautiful friend Amy. I've spoken about her before. We're going to have a video coming up soon, I hope. Thanks, COVID. Anyway, um, she gifted me a beautiful gift. Uh, a bottle of Prosecco came from her. 
this gorgeous little <laughs> it's empty <laughs> well it's a gorgeous can and it's by uh moon dog craft brewery so it's a beer it's a sour ale and i'm not much of a beer drinker but she is so she's teaching me about beers and this is the in the crumble the mighty crumble it's a an apple crumble dessert sour ale sour ale <laughs> try saying that in a hurry and it's delicious and it starts off as a little bit sour a little bit tart and you're supposed to have it chilled and as it sort of warms up and you drink it slowly that sweetness starts to come through it's delicious apparently it's limited edition I think if I remember correctly I don't know but I kept the can because a I love the can the look of the can and B I wanted to show it to you so that plus the Prosecco naughty Amy anyway and the other item that she gifted me which is uber luxurious in my mind anyway is this here so we have the tatcha the dewy skin cream and it is absolutely gorgeous so i love the tatcha products they're beautiful they're japanese in origin beautiful quality so opening it up it says beautiful faces beautiful futures and every purchase from this a certain portion goes towards the education of young girls opening up we have the packaging there like that and you pull it out come on come on <laughs> and it is gorgeous a beautiful sort of lavender ombre lavender jar and it's got the logo at the front across the top it's got a little holder with a little spatula to scoop out the cream and dewy skin cream made in Japan and it's got beautiful ingredients that sort of assist with nourishing the skin keeping it hydrated and anti-aging to some extent and opening it up like that we have it's you can see it's slightly lavender in color and it is so subtle in scent but it is still luxurious it smells expensive but not like an Estee Lauder cream or one of those it just smells it just smells divine but it's subtle it's not the cloying type of strong scent and it's beautiful when I put this on at night I try not to use it every night although that's a waste really but um, the next morning my skin is so soft it just so soft and smooth it's amazing truly beautiful quality toucher quality superb this next little item that I'll be sharing with you I have already shown in my um, birthday outfit of the day video I will link that here if I remember because I say that but then I always forget to do it and this is a pair of beautiful sterling silver earrings these were purchased by my son Samuel for me from him and his siblings I think his girlfriend helped to choose as well and you see me wearing them in that video and this is what they look like so they're like a swirl like a curly six front on they just look like that but of course with movement and side on that's what they look like and these are sterling silver and they're a beautiful earring they're beautiful because I love a dangly earring and uh, yeah I just I just love dangly earrings and he chose well definitely chose well thank you Samuel I have another item to share with you sent to me all the way from Hawaii from my beautiful friend Lisa Lisa loves bags so this came for me a little while ago and she actually just sent it to me as a little pick-me-up but by the time it arrived it was actually my birthday so she said oh well consider it a birthday gift I said okay I will and so she sent me another goodie and this is also from coach and oh here's the dust bag I should show the dust bag and this is what it looks like it is a nice hefty weighty piece and it's silver hardware the uh, traditional coach carriage and the horses in gold all the other hardware is in silver and the code on it is for those of you who are interested f3227 and it's beautiful so it's got the what's this called the dog dog leash clasp it's got the beautiful coach engraved on the actual traditional ring it has coach engraved on the little mechanism that you use to open it it's got a little teeny tiny coach swing tag and of course it's got coach New York engraved on the silver hardware itself there around the horse and carriage beautiful Lisa thank you so much I, honestly I, I was so grateful and surprised and you, you just don't know what it means to me thank you so much and it did come of course with the card the card is beautiful like this it's got the gold and glittery effect and uh, not gold silver and glittery blue and blue is Lisa's favorite color and and she wrote a beautiful 
beautiful message. So thank you. Yes, I will remember. Thank you. Next item I have to share with you came all the way from Pennsylvania. Yes, Pennsylvania. And it's a box of goodies. And if you watch one of my lockdown vlogs just recently, you saw me go to my parcel post and I actually opened it in the car because I couldn't wait. And that is what's in there. My beautiful friend Krista sent me these items very much by surprise. I was expecting something else much smaller. This came and I'm blown away by her generosity. So in them she has included Good and Plenties, which are little licorice sugar coated licorice sweets, much like that. Milano mint chocolate, thin, delicate lady finger biscuits with chocolate in between. We have the Junior Mints. You will see that the cardboard is looking a little bit oily because they have in the heat um, all combined together and melted into one mass. So <laughs> I don't even know how to open it. <laughs> and I love chocolate mint. I love it. Uh, but I'm just going to have to <laughs> all the mint and the chocolate has melted. Oh, Krista, I'm going to have to literally peel off the cardboard and just cut it up into little segments and put it in, put them in a container and keep them in the fridge or something. <laughs> and then my other favourite sweet are these York mints. And so they've got a, a mint inside and covered in dark chocolate. And they're delicious. They're, they're, they're delicious. Love them. Chocolate mint, I'm there. Uh, another goodie, which are snow caps. And these are cute. They're just little chocolate buds with little white dots of sugar on top. And the other goodie that she sent me, which again, I also opened in the car that day. These are the butter cookies, the butter cookies, uh, coated in dark chocolate. But again, because of the heat, and I know it's hot over there, um, they melted. <laughs> so the chocolate melted. I haven't cut into them yet. But they're biscuits and they're supposed to be individual there as you can see it's supposed to be three but they're all one now but they will taste still taste fine even though the chocolate has melted so i've been waiting before i break into these to share them with you and then there were two more items that were in that box which again i showed in my vlog and these are them and the first one is this box and the brand on it here says uh, Pavoy or Pavoir. No, it wouldn't be Pavoir because if it was French, Pavoir would end in S. Uh, so I think this is Pavoy. This is a 14 karat gold plated women's bracelet. It's a seven inch size. And this is the one. It's a tennis bracelet style. It's sterling, uh, 14 karat gold. So it's probably plated but I think it's sterling silver underneath and I've always wanted a tennis bracelet and ever since I opened it that day I have been wearing it ever since and it's beautiful it is gorgeous I'm careful with it don't get me wrong I'm careful with it but I love it and I've put it with these two for a little bit of interest and a little bit of pizzazz how nice is that thank you Krista Thank you so much. Just this, this I, I was not expecting this at all. I, I, I really wasn't. What I was expecting was in this. And I'm not sure if it's the same brand. I can't remember. But it came in this little black box. And inside was the little velour velvety ring holder sponge thing. And the item that was in there is this ring here. So it is a match of the bracelet. And it's an eternity band ring and I had ordered it through Krista for this finger and it fits on that finger there's no problem um, I did go up a size because in summer I tend to puff up so it's never a good look to have a tight ring uh, at the moment it is a little bit loose and you know it's got a fair bit of space there as you can see um, and it's fine it's just I'm just not used to that feeling of you know the width across so I experimented that day when I received it and I popped it on my thumb and that's how I'm wearing it as a thumb ring and because the thumb obviously doesn't rub up against any other finger really the, the width of it doesn't disturb me or bother me at all so on my right hand I have these two rings like this sometimes I play because I have a tendency to play with my rings when I'm teaching when I'm talking to someone when I'm reading whatever and I'll take this off and I'll 
put it on here and I have worn it together a couple of times and that looks nice but again it's just a difference in size so this one I had actually asked Krista to order for me and I intended to send her the money but Krista was very naughty and she didn't let me so thank you Krista thank you for my beautiful goodies they mean everything to me your friendship your support everything there was a card included that's the card there and the card says this is just a little pick-me-up for all you've gone through this past month, well, the last 20 years. You're a very strong woman. One day we'll celebrate in person. Happy birthday. So that's that. So thank you so much, Krista, from the bottom of my heart. Thank you. Thank you. This next item that I have to share with you, I bought for myself. So the next two I bought for myself for my birthday, plus two others that are still to come. <laughs> hey, if you can't splurge and you know spoil yourself on your birthday, when can you? Christmas no but still anyway so the next item is this one here which is in a Netta Porter box but it is not a Netta Porter item this was purchased pre-loved from one of the luxury groups that I'm a member of so it comes in the beautiful packaging got the black Netta Porter ribbon here's the box lid off the beautiful, lovely seller included two masks, so I'm glad now I can start to use them. Inside here we have the tissue paper. And she packaged it really lovely. There. It's a little bit like Chanel, but it's not. Inside is this beautiful white dust bag with Givenchy written on it. And the item inside is something that those of you who know me will probably be surprised that I've purchased but it really spoke to me when I saw this and I watched it for quite some time and then finally um, I communicated with the seller and I bought bum, bum, bum. how pretty is she no idea what she's called no idea what she's called but she's beautiful so she's a gorgeous you know um, is this what color would this like a beautiful tan uh, whiskey or cognac color and it's got the Givenchy logos here the G's uh, facing each other it's got red stitching the leather is soft and supple it is in perfect condition I swear I think she said she only wore it a few times a handful of times there is no, no color transfer on it at all it is beautiful the inside is two-sided so it has one magnet here which is very strong, so it has one magnetized slip pocket. And then it has this side here with the zip sliding down. And it actually comes with just the short handle. The hardware is all perfect. It's not faded or anything. But she did actually add and throw in the long crossbody gold chain strap, which is just a secondhand provider chain strap and it looks very much like the Felici strap I'm, I've been told I'm not sure because I haven't seen the Felici strap but there you go so the gold is slightly different in color but doesn't matter because when you're wearing it it's gorgeous uh, this is not detachable but that's okay because if I'm wearing it crossbody I'll just pop that behind or even in the front and use the long chain strap across the body so this is what I bought for myself it's beautiful I have no idea what it's called if you know please let me know and it's probably a few years old, but it is in exquisite condition. The inside is clean. I love the fact that it's got the Givenchy plaque there and it's red and white, so you can see your things against it. I'm just, I'm loving it. <laughs> Last but not least, and this is an item that I bought myself probably back in May or June, I think it was. Um, this is pre-loved and this is an item I didn't realize I wanted until earlier this year um, at the beginning of the year I think I made the decision then that I wanted to buy this and it's interesting because I fell in love with this item when it first was released I think it was a couple of years ago and I kept telling myself no I don't need it no I don't need it but I kept thinking about it and anyway so I bought this months ago it's been sitting in my wardrobe for a long time and that item is this it's pre-loved and the box is just a little bit squished, can't lie, but opening up the drawer like that, inside is the just the textile card and this is not the actual dust bag, 
that belongs with this item but it was one that was given to me and if I'm not mistaken this is like a shoe bag a sh uh, Louis Vuitton shoe dust bag there's the Louis Vuitton ribbon and inside is the Kirigami set I have wanted this for so long so opening it up we have the main one and I intend to use this as a clutch and if I get myself a never fall then I will use this as a catch-all in there beautiful pink inside is the medium size with the beautiful red and inside that is the teeny tiny one with the beautiful fuchsia or the dark fuchsia so you've got your red the fuchsia and your pink I have wanted this for ages and I bought this at the time it was being advertised I bought this from a reno renowned seller on eBay an Australian seller and I had it authenticated and of course it's authentic and oh my gosh she had initially listed it at above retail um, and I think I made an offer and then there was a coupon code with eBay and I think I got some shop back as in cash back from one of those shop back apps so I picked it up at a good price so there you go so guys that's my part one of my birthday haul let me know what you thought of these items I feel very blessed I'm very lucky let me tell you, none of this came easy to any of us, to those who gifted me these items, to those who sent me these items, to the ones that I bought, that I saved up and bought and saved and saved. Thank you all for your support. I know a lot of people think, you know, they think that we're materialistic and that we're superficial and all that sort of thing, but in the end, we're not. I know what I do. I know what I do to save, to buy these things. I know how hard I work to, to save and buy these things. So I don't judge anyone else and I don't want to be judged in turn. So all the very best, everybody. Take care. God bless. And I'll see you in my part two. Bye. Hey, welcome back to my channel, everybody. My name is Tanya. If you're stopping by for the first time, then welcome. I hope you'll consider subscribing. And if you're not stopping by for the first time, then welcome back. Thank you so much for your support. And today I'm going to share my birthday haul with you. I probably shouldn't have done that because you could see my floppy arms, but oh, let's just say, boy, I, I just went into my teacher mode. Let's just say, guys, that COVID has not enabled me to be fit. So I've got to start changing. that were given to me and this one is a condensation of two packets so that morning I received a box of chocolates which I'll put here should be showing here on the screen uh, a box of chocolates uh, rose chocolate or chocolate roses and these and um, <clears throat> start again but cut out the chocolate stuff like uh, oh, God, I can't talk like What's the point? Gotta hurry up too. Move it, move it, get cracking. Then from my beautiful A, um, and these beautiful items came from my beautiful friend Krista all the way over. And these items came all, the, and I popped it on my ring. Oh, seriously. 